Hey, what's up, everyone? You're in the penalty box with the Puck Dogs. Chris and Rod from PickDogs.com. And Rod, well, we're taking a look at this Red Wings and Canucks matchup. NHL action on Saturday, October 16, 2021. Two young teams that I think are really, really hungry for a win right now. Yep, exactly. And for me, um, the Canucks, this is a tough situation and a tough spot for them to be in. Um, Canucks, they are 2-9 and nine in their last 11 games in the third game in a four-night situation. And that's what we have here. So, uh, for me, Detroit gets their first win of the season. I know they, the last game they played against Tampa, they had the lead, and they should have held on to that lead. And uh, they just choked that thing away and lost in overtime. But uh, it is the defending Stanley Cup chance. But uh, I don't think they choked this one away here. Give me the Detroit Red Wings over the Vancouver Canucks. What's I mean, the lesser of two evils? You take the Canucks, who who battled back and still lost in overtime 3-2, or you, put, you, you, you back the Red Wings, who scored six and still found a way to lose. I, you know what, last time I checked, you need to score more goals than the other team to win the game, and I'm going to take the Detroit Red Wings. They showed some offensive power. Ultimately, the defense let them down. I just think Alex Ndelkovic or Thomas Grice or whoever else you see in here, a better option in goal for than, than whatever Vancouver's putting out. But, uh, Rod, speaking of, do you have any high hopes for the Vancouver Canucks this year, or is this another dead fish in the water? I think last season the Canucks just... Uh... That that COVID situation where they they all the team what was at ninety percent of the team last season got COVID. Um, that kicked their butt. That that's why they had a bad season. This Canucks is definitely young. They've got a lot lots of star power with uh, Patterson, and uh, I think Demko has a a solid season. He, he had a solid start to the season. I know it was a loss, but he lost in overtime. Um, but the Canucks could be good. We might see the Canucks dance a few times. <laughs> Well, we might have to see it. We'll see it in the premium area as well because that's where you can find some of our best bets, some of the top plays of the day, whether it's Rod and I as part of our Puck Dogs package or you go with each either one of us individually or any one of the other fantastic handicappers on the website. Just go to pickdogs.com, check the premium pick section. But while you're there, check out all the free content that we have. Also check out all the videos we're doing here at Pick Dogs. We're doing it bigger and better than anyone else. And, well, we got the morning show. Monday through Friday at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, you get Rod with Brian Bittler, Mitch, and Joe Madden. Got myself co-hosting the drive through with Tony T. Monday through Friday at 6 p.m. Eastern. And we got those weekend morning shows starting at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Don't miss out on those. We'll see you then.